What is up? Matthew Moe here for part two of the Friday First Reaction series for March 16th. So let's keep the party going with Grenade by Claude Van Stroke. Nothing too notable about that song. Standard Claude Van Stroke, so definitely not my favorite out of any of these though, for sure. Next up is Ain't Changing Me by Disturb. This Ice Cube? Uh, What? That was cornball music right there. Next up is Kitchen by Just Say Yes. Oh shit. I enjoyed the intro of that song more than anything. I like percussive. It's more so than the basses that they use in the drop. Like that wub sound was kind of weak. Just didn't stand out too much. I like the skit though. The skit was very, very funny. Next up, Who You Are by Sin Cole. That sounds like a policy song. Not a bad 2013 styled progressive song, if you know what I'm saying, with the super saws and the very halsey sounding vocal. Definitely not my favorite Pyramid release out of late, I think. Usually I expect really good songs of the Pyramid. This is sort of a lukewarm Sin Cole song for me, so I'm gonna skip this one as well. Next up is Corrupt by Chami and Mala. <laughs> The thing about Chami and Mala is their styles are a little bit of an echo chamber. I really, really know what I'm getting when they collaborate compared to when they do separate things, different artists. Like a good example is Mala and Dombreski Hot Style. I thought that was a very interesting song. So this it just didn't wow me in any way. I'm not going to be mad if they drop it on a live set uh, on tour, but nothing I'm going to be necessarily listening to going forward. Next up, Body Language by Tujamo. Yeah, not I don't need to hear DJ Snake style from Tujamo. I need to hear Tujamo from Tujamo. That's going in the trash bin. Not good. Next up is After Hours by Calvin Logue. This song reminds me a lot of Steam Train by Hilo and Chocolate Puma. Very sensible house song. Very nice and percussive, bassy action going on here. So I'm definitely gonna keep listening to the song, uh, see what the energy's at after a couple more listens. Next is Wanted by Sunburn. Very clean house song. Kind of wish it had a vocal or something else added to it. Definitely, not, definitely a vibe, nonetheless. Next up is "Digital" by Boys Noise. Woo! This sounds a lot like the Anna No Slippy Tom song that really slipped a year ago. I truly don't have any correlation, but very similar vibes. Fun break acid house song. Definitely the most left of center song of the new Boys Noise records. Definitely not for everyone, but I enjoyed it. I thought it was very fun, very wacky, and it reminded me a lot of some NLNO hyper house music, so I liked it a lot. Next up is Be Like You by Weathan. Pick it apart, back to the start. I didn't know you. I 
I like that hook a lot. Remind me of Avril Lavigne, some early 2000s teenage emo music for some reason, but very dirty bass line on that as well. Next up is Blaze of Glory by Anna Luno. Oh, It really sounds like Charlie XCX style, sort of what she's been doing with PC music. Not necessarily what I look towards uh, from her, so pretty disappointing. However, this was a surprise drop, so I'm sure she wasn't trying to like trick her fans or anything about this. She was just trying to put it out and see what would happen. Next up is Take Me With You by Glitch Mob. <laughs> I like the pitch down vocals in the beginning, very modern sounding. And then on top of that, you just have what Glitch Mob always does, which is really just execute on their own style and their own sounds. Always come up with new, interesting little switch ups. Next up is Dollar Bill by Angels. <laughs> Really clever flip of Cream by Wu Tang Clan, I believe. The last song is Rado's remix of Ghost Voices by Virtual Self. <laughs> Really the driving kick drum and that boss hi-hat really carried that song. There were just very subtle ghost voices elements scattered throughout it. There's definitely better remixes out there, at least on SoundCloud in my opinion. However, this is very interesting. I wonder if Virtual Self will actually start spinning this. I think it would really flow really well in a Technic Angel set. Out of the 38 songs, my favorites were Bust by Kazqua and DJ Slink, Be Like You by Weathan, Dead Inside, Task of Black, Throttle's remix of My 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 by Troy Shivan, Tasty by Will K, Montana by Francis Go Alendez was super, super cool. Dark Side by Sunstars, I want to hear that either in the Hardwell set or some other set set ultra. I think that'd be very cool to hear. SNH Disco by Boys Noise, that's a complete bop to be honest. Moon Love by Boombox Cartel. Talk is Overrated, Manila Killer Remix, that was also really good. And All I Want by Terry Miko and Goja. Then Songs, they can kind of put a poop emoji over because they weren't very good. Ain't Changing Me by Disturb. Project 9 by Yuki, really too straightforward, too simple. MDR by Party Favor and Bauer, a little too confusing. Didn't feel like a full finished song to be honest. And then I'm gonna have to say Blaze of Glory Band, I don't know. Didn't really like that song at all. What was your guys' favorite new track of the week? Comment below if I missed anything. Also, if you enjoyed the video, remember to like and subscribe. This has been the Friday First Reaction for March 16th. I'll see you guys next time.